hi guys welcome back to my channel step campus so in this video we are going to uh, see another video of hands on that is night was this function okay so just click on solve button and then we will see the test cases first so what we have to do in this one now we have to create a night watch script using phantom browser so this phantom browser they already are taking care so no need to uh, think about the phantom browser okay but what we have to do we have to use this uh, we have to use a function this function to create our test cases so in the previous one what we are doing we are using module.expert and then we are using our test cases to run this one right our function now but in this one they are asking us to uh, create a this function so how the this function is created so let's see so first we will go with the normal approach okay so normal approach means like how we are writing our test cases so this is the test case name right eg selenium so how we are writing we are writing module dot exports right and then we are giving equals to and then inside this bracket uh, we are giving our function name that is easy selenium okay and then we are giving colon okay and then we are writing function and inside this function we are passing a browser right so this is a normal approach okay this is a normal syntax what we are following for every night watch uh, hands on okay but this time they are not asking us to do with this module.expert instead of this module.expert they are asking us to create one this function and uh, perform our testing so how can we do this one let's see so there is some minor change here, okay let's see okay uh, i will delete this one okay now see they are asking us to create a this function so this keyword we have to use okay this dot now module.expert we already given this right so just see in this way okay module dot export means this one okay and then we have to give this function name so control c we will paste here okay equals to we will use this one okay so this is the changes only instead of module dot export we are giving this keyword okay and directly we are giving this function name or you can say the test case name okay and then we are passing this function browser by equals to here we are using colon now here we are using equals sign okay so these are the changes so just remove this one so this is the normal this function okay looks like okay now we can do our for, uh, further testing as before so we will write like browser okay browser we will write one time and we will use this browser multiple times like dot url okay because what we have to do we have to enter the url first okay so let's give the url as https okay and then www.seleniumeasy.com so this is the website what they are asking us to uh, test okay and then we have to wait for the page to load okay so dot wait for see w will be small okay and then f will be capital wait for e will be capital element and v will be capital visible okay and then we have to pass attribute as a body and then we have to give timing so timing i am giving 4 second you can give from your choice okay 2 second 3 second 4 second 5 second whatever you want to give you can give from your end okay so we have covered uh, we have created this function the one step is successfully created second one we are uh, using this url okay third one uh, we have we have to wait for the ps to load so this step will do the same thing and now we have to verify the ps title so to verify the ps title we have to write dot assert dot title okay and inside this function we have to give the title name but title name we don't know okay title name we don't know so what how can we find this one so just copy this url and paste here in a google okay so this website they are asking us to automate okay but we don't know the title so how to get the title so control shift and i okay so once we create uh, click on control shift i so inspect page will open now give control f okay and search title okay so you can see here title is this one okay so how to get the title you have to open the url inspect the page control f to find the tight uh, tag and search with this title tag okay so you will get this one okay 
ओके नाउ पेस्ट द टाइटल एयर पेस्ट द टाइटल एयर ओके सो वी डिड दिस वेरीफाइड टाइटल ऑल्सो नाउ द फिफ्थ स्टेप फिफ्थ स्टेप वार दर एस किंग टू डू वी हैव टू वेट एंड वेरीफाई एंड नेविगेट टू द इनपुट फॉर्म्स सो लेट्स गो टू द वेबसाइट एंड सर्च फॉर द इनपुट फॉर्म सो इफ यू सी दिस वेबसाइट ना सो वी डोंट हैव एनी फॉर्म ओके यू कॉन्ट एबल टू सी एनी फॉर्म इन दिस वेब पेज ओके यू कॉन्ट एबल टू सी एनी वेब पेज इन दिस सॉरी फॉर्म इन दिस वेब पेज ओके सो माइट बी दिस सेलेनियम इजी वेबसाइट हैज बीन अपडेटेड and they have removed the form okay because you can't see anywhere i can't see if you can able to find then definitely let me know i can uh, tell you what we have to do after this step okay but i can't able to find this one maybe like they have updated the website and they have removed that form okay because if you see the test cases na so you will find like we have to find the input form okay and then we have to give the message as selenium is easy and then you have to click on show message then you have to give a uh, input field as a as b 10 and b as 10 so this type of value you have to enter and then we have to click on get it, get total but you can't able to see this type of pages here okay so i am saying like i am not getting but if you can find this uh, form then let me know i will create uh, another video on this one okay meanwhile if you see this thing okay so till uh, step number 4 we already covered okay because we don't find uh, don't able to find this uh, form so we can't proceed further right so let's save it and run it okay so for run uh, to run this one so click on this run button and click on this run run option okay so it will show you the running status okay okay so you can see this assertion two assertion passed one assertion for this uh, 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 for this wait for element visible and then second is for the title okay so you can see these two are passing and click on run and then click on test to see how many test cases are passing okay so you can see two assertion passed and our fs score is 100% means all the test cases are passing i am not sure why it is showing 100% maybe because we are not able to find this demo page so they are taking all all the steps completely from their end May, might be th this is the case or uh any ch any other cases there it won't uh, it will be okay but not uh, not need to worry about these things because uh if tcs asking us to do any hands on then definitely they will provide us the complete uh, url with the complete tag and all okay and complete element as well but you can't see anything here so no need to worry you can see our test case is uh, 100% passed so i think might be they have removed this form and all so the test cases is showing us pass i am also not sure about this one but yeah i am telling you again if you can able to find the form in this website then definitely let me know in the comment box okay i will create a video again okay and then we will see this 5 6 7 8 and 9 step uh, on that one okay so now all the test cases are done then you have to click on the submit button to submit your test cases okay so i hope this is clear to you guys how to use the this function okay so we'll see you in the next lecture thank you bye bye